You know, as it becomes winter, the days get a lot darker, a lot sooner. It gets real depressing, you know? But yeah, I thought a try not to laugh would be helpful in these coming days of depression. It sucks because the sun goes down at like five and it's just awfully depressing when you work from the morning, which is already dark. And then you go to the end, which is, which is like five and you get off and it's dark. Anyways, you know the drill. My friend has sent me some memes. And we're gonna look at them, and determine if they're funny or not. Let's get into the memes. I'm telling you, it's Take off my headset. Holy head to there! 30 seconds. He has too much hair? I mean, I have hair. What? Chat, is there, do I have a headset here? How bad is the, it doesn't feel bad. They are gonna have a very oh, quiet no. bus ride home to the hotel. I'll see you guys tomorrow, bright and early for all. You happy, you happy? Is, is this what you wanna see? Let's see how bad this is, okay? How bad is it? Be honest. I mean, I will get them still. I'm just gonna. Oh my god, look at my hair. Okay, now I'm a little scared. I always have the hat on, so I don't know if it affects me like these guys. But now I gotta check. I also didn't comb my hair, so it probably looks like booty cheeks. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. But god damn. That is. Bad. That's like you need Bosley levels of bad. Jesus. I want to run an isekai D and D campaign. What does that even mean? Well, it'll run like a traditional game of Dungeons and Dragons. However, during character creation, you're only allowed to give your character ability scores and proficiencies that mirror your own. How would we even determine that? Through real life challenges. Like for instance, we'll determine constitution through a drinking contest. Each shot you down will be a plus one to your overall constitution score. Is this just an excuse to get drunk? Yes, but also no. There's a whole system, I promise. Okay, well what about intelligence? We do a Kahoot of random trivia, and for each answer you get right, you add plus one until the Kahoot ends, maxing out at 20. Dexterity? We'll each take turns balancing on one leg and having stuff thrown at us by the other players, and for each object you successfully dodge, you get plus one to your score. Okay, now it just sounds like an excuse to bully us. I mean, that's basically what D&D is. Fair point. I think I'm starting to understand, but I do have one more question. How would you determine charisma? Oh, that's easy. You add plus one for every successful date you've been on in the last year. I'm sorry, what? Just gonna real quick mark you down for a negative five? Hey! Dude, I was really about to be like, I kind of want to try this. And then he said the last part, and I was just like, fuck. Shit, we're in the fridge. Oh, it's a freaking hork. No, God, no. Like in the hallway. Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> bro, I, I couldn't scream. Bro, like, yo, bro, like, I genuinely got so scared. I, I don't know what game that is, but I'm never playing it. Man, that's crazy. That's crazy you would play that. I'm never playing that. That looks awful. Put it down in the description what the name of that game is, and I'll play it for you. I'm not going to look in the comments. You guys need to work for it if you want me to play it. Beginning the flash, you make call. Oh, is this the seal bear operator? You guys know him? Thank you. Where is she? I'm not allowed to accept him. You are, you're not allowed to accept no. him, so you are allowed. You are. Get off the camera! Oh, okay, okay, go, go! Okay, where I go? I, I love that clip. I, I think I've already seen it on this. Uh, on one of the old Try Not To Laughs, but like, God, that is just such a great clip. That is gaming with the boys peak level. Oh, hey, it's a Eastern neutral grasshopper. They'll be found all over North America. Very friendly. Whoop, there he goes. <laughs> Man. So I sat there and watched his toenails fall off because you, you just don't use everything you see on the internet. It's not true. I don't know one time I've ever been like touched by a grasshopper that I thought to myself, wow, what a beautiful creature of nature. No, the first thing I would have done is I would have stomped it out.
なんでここだけ銀座にあるカジュアルなアメリカンダイニングスポーツバージャリーダーイメージのフーターズガールによる最高のおもてなしアメリカンフード片手にスポーツ観戦できる店楽しいが確定アメリカンフードはかなり充実コブサラダにフライドピクルスこのチキンが特にめっちゃもぐぜひ行ってみてくださいはぁ They're just giving me so many reasons to go. Like, I just. Now, if they would just give me money, I would go. Like, honestly, just give me the money to go. I would stay there. So, what we work every day? It seems like a blessed place. If you don't do anything, then five people will die. But if you choose to pull the lever, a different five people will die. But you also get this crisp $5 bill. What do you say, buddy? $5! Yeah! The trolley problem at its finest. Have you guys ever seen a crisp $5 bill, though? One that's not been folded or like aged or anything. Oh, they're beautiful. Like pr freshly printed. I don't know what, what it is about it. Like you, you just want to frame it. Like Mr. Krabs in that SpongeBob episode. We do a little tomfoolery. Yeah. We're doing silly mode. Yeah. We're up to some buffoonery. Yeah. We're doing nothing but clowning. Yeah. We're up to some nonsense. I don't know why that almost made me laugh. It, I think it was like the silliness. Yeah, what was this like? Silly mode. Yeah, silly mode. I don't know why silly mode almost got me. Oh, a mime. I love mime. Really clever. What's that? A backpack? Yeah, what's in the backpack? What's where are you going? Actually, can I see the backpack? I should probably look inside the backpack. Yeah, just hand me the back. Why are you shutting the door? Open the door. Who's this? What are you pouring in the top? Oh, let me in! Let me in! Oh. Oh. All right. The hell are, the hell are these? Hard drives. Why are you trying to flush hard drives down the toilet? Why is that freezer locked? Let me look inside the freezer now. Get the key, open it up. That's it. Holy shit! How did you fit so many bodies in there? They're so young! The hell is that? You sick! You want to get off it? Son. Don't do something you can't come back from. Where's she going? No. You come back. Hand me the gun. Hand me the gun. That's it. Hand me the gun. That's it. Mate. No! That got so real so fast. This man's really good at his job, man. Boy. I don't even know what to say to that. I was just... That was crazy. That was actually... Uh, that was really good. Bro, we were just having a nice stroll through the park and then we saw this mime like... I don't want to talk about it, man. Your bad skill issue. You crashed your car into my house, and I have the skill issue? Just move your house out of the way next time. They're so stupid. Like, I love it. This. All those people who said stick figures wouldn't amount to anything. Just look at this man. Look at this man making these great of stick figure memes. You can do anything you put your mind to. All been by unanimous decision, but you gotta be careful. <laughs> But is it better than the Jake Paul Mike Tyson fight? Yes, 100%. Dude, okay, sorry. Everyone talks about the Jake Paul Mike Tyson fight, but if you saw that first fight, why was that dude humping that other guy? Like, did nobody see that? Did we glaze over that? I haven't seen anything about it. Like, that was just like. These are nicknames for your friend named Chris or Christopher. Chris Army Knife. The Mississippi River. Krista Boots with the Fur. Proceeding Hairline. I Krista Girl and I liked it. Abistopher. A little of Chris, a little of Krat. A swing and a miss, Defer. Oh, I'm just so chris off. Take out the beginning and the end and just go with stop. Ignorance is Chris. Crisis. Krispy Kreme. I'm gonna make him a chris offer he can't refuse. Bro, if you're using I'm gonna make him a chris offer he can't refuse as a nickname, maybe you should rethink making nicknames. Like, that's just not a good one. Like, it's a good, like, wordplay, but like, I don't think it's a good nickname. Nicknames are usually shorter than the actual name, hence the name Christopher being shortened to Chris. These are just my thoughts. Welcome to my Chris talk. How do you feel about streamers saying streaming is harder than a real job? Streaming harder than a real job? <laughs> Bro, what?
Nah, bro. I'm sorry, man. No. There ain't no way. I saw a YouTuber say, like, man, y'all just don't understand. You wouldn't understand until you get in this position. This is, like, this is more difficult than just normal 9 to 5. Well, guess what, Chad? I am in the position, and I can sit here and tell you it's not even close to as hard as a real job. I ain't about to sit here and tell y'all, like, oh, man, I'll be working hard. Bro, I don't. I get to hang out with my people for four hour, uh, four hours a day, bro. I wake up at, like, 2 p.m. every day, get up, don't do nothing all day, and I sit here and stream, bro. Even becoming a streamer, people's like, oh, man, you got to work so hard to become a streamer, become a YouTuber. I'm going to keep it a stack with you right here. It's 90% luck, 10% working hard, bro. I, I ain't never going to sit here and tell you I ain't here because I got lucky. It's still hard work, though. Yeah, I'm not saying there's no hard work involved, but I am saying that 90% of it is getting lucky. If becoming a streamer or a YouTuber was only based off of hard work, there would be tens of thousands of more. That's crazy. You literally didn't need this. Sorry. I, I don't... Un and Kezo makes like a really good point. Although I have no right to agree to it. Because I don't know. I'm not in his position. I don't think I'll ever be in his position. But it's just fun to make these videos for me. I like doing them. That's all I need to do. This is what I come home to. I do this. It's fun. I don't make it... I don't waste my time making like five videos a week or like seven videos streaming nonstop. If you want to do that, you want to be famous, whatever, good for you. I just want to have a good time. <laughs> That's it. That's the only reason I make these videos. I do it for you guys. Maybe uplift your day. That's it. That's all I'm hoping for. Because God knows we need that. But stop putting these freaking videos inside these. I would have watched this without it. Hey, so you said you've driven before, right? Yeah, while well, in like GTA. Wait, hang on a second. I was not expecting the real life. I was, I really thought it was gonna be stick figure crash. Like this was gonna go into like the one that went into the house. This, that's not what happened at all. Dude, that's how I felt when people started playing Yakuza and then didn't like Yakuza. Like, come on, man. It's a really good game. It's got great story. It's funny. It's like, it gets you in your feels. There's cool mini games. I'm telling you, like, for example, Yakuza Like a Dragon, not the one that just came out, the one before that, had a great game about building a cookie business. I could not stop playing that game. I became a multi billionaire in a video game. And I do it again. That game was so much fun. You don't understand the struggles of playing video games, man, and making a multi billion dollar business. You'll never get it. I don't like I this. I am a god. High IQ okay. gamer. Let's go. <laughs> and that's when you get... That's beautiful. You give yourself praise. Almost immediately you get clapped. That's how I play games or I don't play at all. It's always the, I am a genius. I am a god. And then you immediately get clapped. Oh my god, there's no way I choked that. Fuck. That's bullshit. Holy How did he not know? I just want to know the circumstances of how he got there. Or did he just forget he was so enamored with the game? Like, that's happened to me before. ヨガ。男は女に、女に後ろ。見せぶりで女に寄せることです。俺のハブで女に寄します。いやいや。おっぱい見る。イエーイ。あそこでおっぱい見る。大画面で。iPad never get that out of me. I go to sleep. All right, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. That's all the memes I have for today. Did you laugh? Did you lose? I'll give you a breather since Thanksgiving's next week. And if you didn't laugh, whatever, I mean, that's fine. If you did, have a great Thanksgiving. That's all I gotta say. Not the people who did laugh, I mean, but like, everyone who didn't laugh, have a great Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for watching. 
Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see all you people in the next video. <clears throat> You're wonderful. <laughs> Almost forgot that part. Bye.